Hello there, welcome to my business page, South Bay Yoginis. My name is Valinda Kokella. I'm the owner of South Bay Yoginis. And I'm teaching you what I teach in my live classes. Thanks so much for showing up today for my Motivational Monday, 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time on Mondays. And I'm gonna make sure you can hear and see me okay. Please say hi if you're live with me and I will say hi back. We have got some noise going on here. Pacific Standard Time on Mondays. All right. Yeah, I'm gonna make sure you can hear and see me okay. Please it looks like I am good. Not. So please like my business page. This is my business page, Selfie mm -hmm. Yoginis. Follow me on YouTube, Valinda Yoga. Please subscribe and comment and let me know what you wanna work on. Today we are cleansing the space around the body. So this is the eighth chakra. This is the aura. If you don't know who I am, I'm Valinda Kokella. I'm the owner of SelfieYoginis.com. And I've been practicing yoga since 1994 and teaching since 2000. That's my passion to help you, whoever is watching this video, create peace in your body, mind, and spirit using tools and techniques I have been teaching and practicing for over half my life. So again, thanks so much for watching. So these little one minute yoga hacks I actually just taught in my class this morning. So this is a great way to feel grounded, especially after you've possibly been in a heated conversation or you've been stressed out, you're, um, you know, all the stuff going on right now in the world has just been crazy the facebook stuff and everything so let me know um let me know you're here i see i have someone live so and i'll say hi to you so this is a great thing to do either before you leave the house or when you come home and if you want to sign up for one of my three minute daily meditations um, I can send you this daily meditation. This one is called Strengthening the Aura. So the aura is the culmination of your seven main chakras, the energy centers along the spine, into the space around the body. So it's the space around the body. It's our ability to set boundaries, our ability to be clear, our ability to not take on the problems of the world, which I don't know about you. Hey, Marjorie, welcome. But it's been crazy as a highly sensitive person taking on feeling like I'm, I have to take on the problems of the world and I'm telling you right now you do not and having a daily yoga meditation practice or even a, a few times a week will totally help you so we're going into my last week of my online zoom class so please join me for that those are twenty dollars to drop in just reach out to me and I will send you the link the zoom link and you can also get the replay if you can't come live those are Wednesdays at 11 a.m. Um, to 12 15 p.m pacific standard time uh, but yeah if you want to come live reach out to me and uh, and just come to my zoom class live so we're gonna hop right into the yoga hack for the day so strengthen the aura oh good marjorie yeah i don't know about you but it's just been like crazy feeling like i have to take on the problems of the world and you know the, the mask and the no mask and the vax and the no vax and just all the arguing on facebook i actually have been taking some time off um, of Facebook. I'm doing a lot of TikToks right now, having a lot of fun over on TikTok. And if you follow me on Instagram, Valinda Yoga, I am posting my TikToks over there. But yeah, I think I'm going to be taking a break from this South Bay Yoginis page actually uh, in the new year. So I'll go ahead and finish out till the end of the year. And then we're going to just be doing some fun new stuff. So if you're in to some new stuff with me, say, yes, I'm in Valinda and give me some thumbs up and come to my Zoom classes. These classes can make a huge difference in your life uh, and they're by donation. So I do ask for a $20 donation. And then you can get the replay and you can do it whenever you want. So adding a yoga meditation practice to your life, I would say one to three times a week. Right now we're on day 28 of a daily meditation practice, which I do a daily practice and it really, really helps me, um, you know, to be clear and to set boundaries. And hey Kim, welcome. And just to be a better mom and to be a better human and uh, it just really helps me in my life so I love sharing that with you guys so thanks so much for hanging out with me and let's jump right in so if you're sitting on, a, on the couch or in a chair uh, make sure you, you have space around your body so we are going to be working with the vertical aura so that's this space and then the horizontal aura that's this space and we're just going to do 30 seconds of each so if you have any uh, injuries in your body, definitely listen to that and just uh, do what you can do. So we're gonna be inhaling as we reach the hands up and the backs of the hands are gonna come close to each other but not touching and then exhaling as you bring the hands down. And that's it, we're gonna be here for 30 seconds. So inhale, reach your hands up. You're gonna spread your fingers. Exhale as you bring your hands down. Do sit up tall. Make sure your shoulders are over your hips. We wanna have our erector's muscles holding us up. So those are the muscles on the sides of your spine. So your eyes are gonna gaze up 
You're going to press the tongue at the roof of the mouth. Close the eyes if you're comfortable. And that's it. Breathe only through the nose. And just see the light around your body. See your brightness. That's your aura, your eighth chakra. You can inhale sat, exhale nam, or I am. Truth is my name. And I'm tensing my fingers to kind of um, call on our health, our, our wellness, call on our communication, call on our patience and our devotion, call on our expansion, call on our ego. Good. And then inhale, reach it up. Really feel that stretch here. Let me put my camera up a little bit so you can see me better. Feel that stretch. And then we're going to exhale, bring the hands down, and then we're going to go right into the horizontal aura for 30 seconds. So you're going to bring your hands in front of you. Again, tense your fingers. So pinky, communication, ring, health and vitality, patience, devotion, expansion, and ego. You're going to inhale as you kiss your shoulder blades together. Again, shoulders over hips. Let's pull our pelvic floor up. Your tongue is pressing. Your eyes are gazing up. And that's it. 30 seconds. that you've carried with you, other people's stuff, all your triggers, and whatever it is, just clear it out. Good, last 10 seconds. You can speed it up if you want. Good, and then inhale, reach your arms out. Palms are going to face up. Get in the camera. <laughs> And just see light coursing up through your left palm, down through your right palm. So light all around you. Hold it, hold it. Wrap your muscles around your bones. Hi, Stephanie. Welcome. So great to see you. Stephanie's done all my online courses. She's actually doing our 40-day sadhana with us right now. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. And let's exhale. Left palm, right palm, thumbs touch. And just sit. back of the body. See your mind as still as a pond. Let the neck be relaxed. The lower spine is relaxed. Heart is slightly lifted. Breathe deeply into the bottom of the lungs. Inhaling I, exhaling in. See your beautiful higher self above your head like an angel watching over you. See your grounding cord from your root chakra connecting you to the center of the earth, grounding yourself in your human form. We're having this human experience. Send some golden light down, a chain with an anchor or a cat's tail from your root chakra. And again, just see light all around you, clearing out the space around your body. I relax from outer involvement into my inner haven of peace. Secure in myself, I accept whatever is. Good. And then bring your palms together. Let's press our pinkies, our ring finger, our middle finger, our index finger, and the thumb. And let's press right into CV17. So that space right about an inch or two above where your ribs meet. And just press there, conception vessel. Press the palms together. Balance the left and right hemispheres of the brain. Balance the left and right sides of the body. And inhale and hold your breath, kumbaka. Breath retention. Suspend the mind in bliss. And just say a wish or a prayer. Whatever you want. Don't filter it. Good. And exhale. And then just touch the third eye. Touch the heart. And touch the navel. Gently bow. Bringing your forehead to the earth. 
and that was the little yoga hack for the day. I hope this really reset you for the day. So I've been teaching these for many years on this page. If you're on my YouTube channel, again, please subscribe, Valinda Yoga. If you're on my South Bay Unionese page, please like it and comment and, um, and let's share this out with people so we can be centered, we can feel centered, we can uh, feel better in our body, mind, and spirit every day. So we are on day 28 of Ganapati Kriya, which is a mantra that we're chanting. I'm doing it for 11 minutes and uh, we're just loving it. It really helps to activate the vagus nerve when we sing or we hum, or we even do these like amazing breathing techniques that we do in yoga and meditation. So I'll throw it in the comments if you wanna jump in and just jump in for our last uh, 10 or 11 days with us and, and let me know how it works for you. I'm also gonna throw in the three minutes to brighten the aura if you wanna do that or just do this one every day. If you, if you only have a minute, this can absolutely serve you. Thank you, Marjorie, for coming live. Stephanie, thank you for being here live. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you so much for being live. I so appreciate it. So yeah, any questions? I'm gonna be taking some time off um, coming up, so I won't be making events. Uh, I think I'll be here next week. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna not do these anymore at the beginning of the year because um, I'm gonna do something new. So, you know, watch this page, hang with me, go to my website, southbayugenies.com. Make sure you get on my email list because I do send out an email every week. And I always tell you guys what we're working on. I always tell you what meditation we're doing. We did six meditations, 40-day uh, meditations this year. Um, and we might do another one. I'm, I'm thinking about doing uh, the Removing Negativity, the six-minute one, um, as we go into the holidays. So if you want to do that with me, give me a thumbs up. Let me know. Say, Valinda, I am in. I would love to to contribute and to help and to do six minutes a day and then get in my group conversations with my soul sisters kundalini yoga meditation and wellness that is women only and we're supporting each other every day in doing these practices that help sustain us from the inside they just help us better oh yeah stephanie i know i still have all my zippy courses on my website so you can you can go sign up for that now i'm not running them live right now because it's my daughter's senior year and um, I'm teaching live classes at my home again, and uh, I'm teaching back at the gym. So yeah, but yeah, you can go to my website, southbayugenies.com, and buy uh, any course that you want. I have six online courses. Yeah, Stephanie did them all with us. And then we did a teacher training last year. Hi, Kim, welcome. Thank you for being here live. So any questions, you have me all to yourself. It's like having a yoga teacher in your pocket, all my 27 years of experience. Um, so yeah, the, the six minutes to remove negativity, which is, I think going to be our next meditation, it's working with pressure points. So you literally just press into different points in the body. You pull, you pull, and then, um, so it's all seated. You can do it in a chair or on the couch. So if you have any injuries, you can absolutely do this work. So yeah, and you know, we've been here for five years doing this. Um, my online business I started five years ago. So it was a very easy transition to do a teacher training online. Let me know if you're interested. Um, I'll be happy to start another one. And all this information is on my website, southbayoginis.com. So make sure you sign up for my emails. And I'm going to stay one more minute. If you have any questions, let me know. Yeah, grab my Udemy course. That's another one. I think Marjorie... Stephanie and Kim have done my Udemy course. I have like over 1,200 students with um, all five-star reviews on that one. That one's really fun. And those are like 20 to 30 minute classes that you can just do really quick. And my YouTube channel too has tons of stuff. All right, you guys, I like to keep these to 15 minutes. So um, I make sure you watch them and you do this work. So thanks so much for hanging out with me. Bring your hands together, inhale, sat. Exhale, Nam. Truth is my name. Truth is your name. Still your mind. Open your heart. Speak your truth and live your dreams. Follow me on all my social channels. Valinda Coquella on um, Facebook. Make sure you friend me here um, because I'm not going to be doing lives on this page anymore. Follow me on Instagram, Valinda Yoga, and on TikTok, Valinda Yoga, and YouTube, Valinda Yoga. So thanks for hanging out. Let me know what you want to work on, and I will be happy to teach you. Yeah, Marjorie, yeah, you've done a lot of my online courses. Just message me. I'll send you the link. But it's southbayoginis.zippycourses.com.
okay? SouthBayUginis.ZippyCourses.com. And if you don't remember your password, just create a new one. Okay? All right. Thank you, guys. See you next week. Bye.